Throw on top. Um, or, or peek around down there. Do you need to put it in a little sack? Do you yeah, do resale? I do. Or, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm just always curious. Yeah. You know, what are you going to do? I mean, every now and then something in here I might keep. Oh, but... okay. Either way. Yeah. I am glad that we can provide you with things. Yeah. Me too. I will have to take a few trips. Okay.
Forgot my bag. Morning. have one of these so I think I'll pair this one with that. Did you look in the clothes? Yeah, I found like one jacket and it's fifteen dollars. What is it? Like a woman's winter jacket. Like a Columbia. It's expensive. Can you show it to me?
Two thousand. That's It's like a double it's jack. It's a powder keg. So this is probably from the women's coats. The nineties. will be in the back. Should you want to know that? Thank you. So, vintage Columbia. They would have the names of their coats on the back. So kind of get a better idea. Very similar, about 25 bucks, 30. So if they priced it for like five, maybe. Sizer. That's a cellar sizer. Oh. Some sort of trampoline. Can I miss this? No, it's not in good shape. Should probably get it, eh? What the hell is that? I mean, it hasn't sold, but. <clears throat> I don't know, but I'm pretty sure I saw they accept cards. Is that another one? Oh, yeah. I saw that yesterday. I couldn't decide. Also, couldn't decide about this, but I think it has a stain on it. Not minty venti though. Hey Jonas, can you look up vintage Land's End fleece? See if that has any value. I get it just for the yeah lands end. Apparently, this is a men's size large. Yeah, I thought it was women's. Everywhere. Here's some little 
Are they selling? Yeah. For seventeen. Mm. You look up this Columbia XCO shirt. sell through rate like how many are listed versus how many have sold seven fifty six and how many have sold but those are a lot of like short sleeve mm -hmm. what would you do saw this I couldn't, couldn't decide on this it's also not really sweater season sweater buying season that Eddie Bauer yeah vintage Eddie Bauer sweater and we've got that main street <clears throat> you would look good wearing this I don't I think I just want to buy this for you is it another Eddie Bauer? Right yeah, put that on. It's hard because of the uh, wearing the sweatshirt underneath. But is that something you'd wear at school? You could say no. Probably not. All right. to get upwards too. We had this when I was a kid and we would play it all the time. Have you played it before? Um, yeah. Courtney would probably kill me. I suck. <laughs> Two didn't have prices, but 
25 cents. <laughs> What's that? And then 25 cents uh, and three dollars. Whichever okay. the bag would be just fine. <laughs> you're, buying, you're getting three Mad Men sets, I see. In different seasons. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> do you take cards? I do take cards, yeah. Okay. I only have 28 or 24, so. <laughs> Hey guys, I wanted to do a quick recap on some of the items that I found there because I think a few uh, or a lot of the items were hard to see in the video. So let's take a look at some of the uh, some of the best finds that I found here. So we'll start with this uh, Coleman. This is a Coleman heater, a uh, vintage heater, and uh, bought it for five bucks. I don't know how to test it or if I'll be able to, but uh, those have a pretty good comp anywhere from like 30 to 50 dollars on those so that was a good pickup for five dollars this uh nikon cool picks l5 camera uh, i think it's brand new in the box i opened it up and all the plastic is still on everything so i think brand new like this i can sell it for maybe 80 or more uh bought it for 10. so that was a good find I picked through all the DVDs and I found a bunch of the Mad Men seasons and I think I have all of the seasons that are in uh, this series. And I looked up online and I think uh, the comps for those are anywhere between $40 to $60 on that. These are some of my favorites. These don't necessarily have great uh, high dollar amounts, but I just love the real old uh, ugly Christmas sweaters like not the kind that are made now that are purposely made to be ugly but these are the old ones that kind of inspired the trend so this is a tiara international Christmas collection uh, zip up sweater with some really fancy like beadwork on it but definitely what I would classify as a Christmas sweater so I got that one or ugly Christmas sweater, I should say I got that one and then this blizzard bay uh, old goat ugly Christmas sweater. Paid six dollars for both of them. I think you'll probably get anywhere between 15 and 25 a piece for those. Speaking of Christmas, I found my first uh, Christopher Radko ornament. 